because my last Halloween mystery box, I didn't actually get a box. I figured, you know, I'm gonna get another one and hopefully this one comes as a box. And it did, I got another Halloween box. So this one is going to be my happy Halloween eBay mystery box unboxing. I got my box in the mail today and this is what it looks like. It's a pretty big box, so I am excited. It's got some, some heft to it. So we're gonna see what is inside our mystery box, which I never checked to see how much I paid for it. I, <laughs> I paid $20 for this box. It was free shipping. The title of it was Halloween Mystery Boxes for Halloween. No junk you will love. So I don't know, let's see. We shall see if there's junk in here, if we're gonna love it or not. I'll be the judge of that. So let's tear on into it. Gosh, these are so much fun. What's inside? Nobody knows. One day I am gonna open one of these mystery boxes and it's gonna be so awesome. I'm gonna be like, this is why I've been doing mystery boxes. I can't believe I got this. Yeah, right, I can keep dreaming, right? So this one's supposed to be Halloween goodies. Let's get our Halloween on. Okay, so, what the hey, there's something right on top here. All right, let me just show you guys what I'm seeing as soon as I open it up. This is all I'm kind of really seeing. It looks like they have some tissue paper in there. So, but there's something right on top here in this like clear plastic. Okay, well, I, I don't know. right off the bat here, I don't consider this Halloween. Uh, these appear to be Monster Energy Drink sticker decals. I mean, it's kind of cool. I don't drink um, monsters. Neither does my boyfriend. He prefers the rock stars, but these are actually pretty cool. Um, there's this like huge one, like this one's massive. I mean, I guess it's kind of, could be considered Halloween-y just because of how it looks, but I wouldn't necessarily consider it Halloween. Um, and then these are just three regular stickers, different sizes and shades. So those were on top. Oh, it looks like everything is actually individually wrapped in tissue paper. So that's fun. It's kind of like unwrapping presents. So let's just start. Our first thing feels like um, soft cloth, like a soft cloth. What is it? What? Ooh, I think it's a t-shirt. It's a tank top. What does it say? I tolerate you. Oh my God, that is so cute. Um, this might be a little small for me. It is a size small, but you know, I could maybe wear it to bed or something. So that is really cute though. I like that. I tolerate you. Ha! Huh. It is by a brand called Black Matter and it is a size small. I typically wear a medium, but I'll probably still wear it. Maybe like to bed in the summertime or something. So that's not so bad. Like already I feel like I, I got my money's worth with just this tank top. I mean, I only paid $20 for the box with free shipping. So next we have this here. This feels hard. It feels like a book. So let's open it up. <gasps> oh my God, what the heck? <laughs> oh, that's funny. This is called the Redneck Grill. The most fun you can have with fire, charcoal, and a dead animal by Jeff Foxworthy. Oh my God, that's hilarious. I may have to give this to my dad. He'll find this amusing. Um, yeah, that's funny. And this is hardcover. It's actually really nicely made. It's kind of, like it's got like all the pages are made of like thick cardboard if that makes sense it reminds me of like a a child's like first book kind of thing and this actually has a price of $15.99 on the back so definitely already got my values worth as far as money goes um this has recipes like patio pot roast beer can chicken grilled rabbit maple grilled pound cake <laughs> so probably not a whole lot of things that i would make it does look like there are some things in here that aren't like completely 
crazy. Like right there, I see like some teriyaki salmon. So not everything is just like, what the heck kind of thing. So that's funny. So we got that. Next, we have this little package here. I have no idea what it is. I can't even, I can't even guess. So, oh, it looks like an actual like Halloween decoration. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that is so adorable. Look at that. So it says welcome at the top here. This is from Dollar Tree, just letting you know. I know because of the, the green briar tag on the back. I'm a Dollar Tree shopper. I know these things. Um, but then we have various little glittery pumpkins. That one's like a chevron print, polka dot. Another chevron. That is really cute though. I do, I do like that. That is adorable. So yeah, this box is pretty good, you guys. Um, next we got this package. There's a lot of little packets in here. This one also feels like a uh, cloth. It looks like a little drawstring or a little backpack. What's it say? This is a NOS. Is that how you pronounce it? Energy drink? So more energy drink. Maybe they work for an energy drink like distribution company. I don't know. Um, this is just like a little backpack though obviously you could use this so like if you're going trick-or-treating it would make a good um bag to use as you know to fill up with candy i wish i was still going trick-or-treating my goodness i missed that um now i gotta buy all my candy instead of going door to door for it okay next is this little package here um no idea what it is i can't i can't decipher um <laughs> Ooh, we got some tea light candles. Again, these are these are Dollar Tree too, luminescence. Uh, but they are pumpkin cheesecake, and they smell absolutely wonderful. So those are nice, and those are though those are votives. Did I say they were tea lights? They're votives. So they smell really good though. I like that. I like this box. Next, we got this little gold makeup bag. It's black on the other side and there's something inside of it. Ooh, it's an Ipsy bag. I just noticed that. I'm not subscribed to Ipsy. Always wanted to. Wouldn't it be awesome if there was some like Ipsy makeup in here? Oh, that would be so awesome. Oh my God, everything in here is also wrapped. This box is awesome. I'm totally buying more boxes from this lady. Let's see if she has some like regular boxes. Ooh, and I think this is makeup because this is LA Colors. Again, Dollar Tree, but you know what? I'm a Dollar Tree shopper, so I don't mind. Um, this is, oh, ooh, these are awesome. We got some LA Colors Enchanted Black Light Reactive Nails. I love those. I've never seen these at my Dollar Tree before, but I haven't, I haven't been in a while. Um, but those are cool. I definitely really like them. Um, next is, this feels like, Maybe a piece of jewelry or something. Okay, I was right. It's a bracelet. And that's really cute. What does it say? It says... Ch... Ch... Chave... Itty... It... Or... For... I... I... Ch... Chavez... For... So, I don't know. It's nice though. It's just like um, a purple with this little dangly feather here. And it's stretchy. And I don't know, it's cute. I don't know if it was handmade or not, but that's cute. Um, there's one other thing in the bag and this also feels like a bracelet. Ah! What is it? Okay, so this one is just... Is this another monster energy this is a monster energy um like black rubber type bracelet so we got that and there's still more stuff in here oh my goodness let's go with this this looks like another halloween kind of decoration probably from dollar tree but i'm not complaining this box has definitely been worth the 20 bucks um yes this is dollar tree as well oh cute too it says i've got my eyes on you and it's like a jar of eyeballs how cute is that that 
is so adorable. And it just has the little ribbon up here to hang it with. That is so cute. These are all things that like, I don't know if I would have purchased on my own, but like having like someone had purchased them for me, it's pretty cool. Um, these things were just thrown in here. These were not wrapped. This is awesome. It's a lollipop and it is a little monster finger. It's only like a really long stick. So that's cool. And then we also got these Wilton doilies. So these would be cute to put, um, little, like to display little cupcakes or they have it displaying like a little cake kind of thing. So I don't know if I'll get use out of these or not, but I'll put them with all of my other like cake decorating things just in case I ever need them for something. And then this is our last thing. Um, it feels like a mask or like a mold of something, like a mold for like a cake or something. And it is a mask. <laughs> oh my God, okay. How does this work? Oh my goodness. I think it actually like seeps blood or something. So it's this skull, it looks like Skeletor, doesn't it? Um, this skull mask here. And it's got this like tubing, I'll show you guys. There's this tubing, and then it has this bag, which looks like, let me open it. it yeah. Yeah. Oh my, oh my god. Ew! Ah! Look! Like, even the container that it's in is awesome. It looks like a heart, and there, I, I'm assuming there's, like, actual, like, fake blood in here. So, you would hook it up to this apparatus right here and then it would flow through these tubes and then I think like seep into the underside of the plastic of the mask that's so crazily weird so I don't know if we um I don't know if we're handing out trick-or-treat candy or not this year uh, we probably will so maybe my boyfriend will wear this um for when we do that that was in this box this box like I said was only $20 with free shipping I definitely feel like I got my money's worth with this box I was very pleasantly surprised with some of it now not everything I think is something that totally was like oh yeah I always wanted that kind of thing but that's with any mystery box and with the things that I don't want I always ask like friends and family if they're interested in it I don't charge them obviously you know just give it to them or you know I, get, I donate it to a thrift store just to you know it doesn't go to waste is what I'm saying so I hope you guys enjoyed this video um had to do another Halloween this will be the last Halloween obviously uh, but I definitely want to do more eBay mystery unboxings I think they're so much fun I'm just having too much fun doing them to just stop altogether and this one really has built up the the excitedness for me because I actually like was really happy about some things in here so I'm definitely gonna be on the lookout for some more maybe not necessarily um theme just you know find some maybe mystery boxes so let me know down below if you think this box was worth the $20 free shipping what your favorite thing out of it was what you thought was like the coolest uh but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you next time